What's gravy, baby? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy Troy Fowler, Troy Way. I never leave you astray, you me? This video, I'm gonna go over with you guys. It is a buyer's market right now, okay? So watch this video, watch the whole video if you wanna get up on what's going on with the market, because right now is probably the best time to build your team and get your team up to par before new promos and things of that nature drop, okay? So, um, today what's going to happen um i believe there will be a new promo coming out the unstoppable promo so i'm going to go over there real quick because you guys may have some questions with some of these objectives so if you guys see right here um with this one get 50 first downs with three unstoppable players in your lineup you cannot do this right now okay you can't do this until the unstoppable promo drops will be a little bit later today um or if you're watching this video later it will be dropped today which is october 5th unstoppable players and you will be able to put three of those in your lineup and you can actually get that objective done um but you can't do it right now these cards do count as unstoppable players um the randy moss the aaron donald and the like jason kelsey but obviously nobody's going to be able to get the level 15 right now so um pretty much just wait on that unstoppable promo to drop today and you know you should be good to go ahead and get that dropped um i know with the daily objectives i noticed 35 days pretty much to get the daily objectives and they shorten the days on us guys it's 41 days right now it's 41 goddamn days for us to do these promos right now okay i mean not the promo the field pass it's 41 days you have to do the daily objectives for 35 plus days so 35 days to get the full amount so you only can miss it looks like you only can miss five days okay you can only miss five days five six days but you're pushing it you hear me you're pushing it if you miss five or six days so you guys gonna have to really be on this i know it's ridiculous i know it's crazy but hey it is what it is this is just what we have to do to get the free xp that we need to get from ea you got that good so that's just some little pointers that i have to give out when it comes to that um to the field pass right there and those objectives um as far as the buyer's market what's going on right now it's very very cheap to build your team at this point in time i don't know how much longer these prices are going to hold maybe after new promos drop like most feared or this unstoppable promo maybe these cars are going to raise but i'm telling you guys right here right now you need to go ahead and try to take advantage of this buyer's market because you look at the 86 overalls they were uh, they were literally above 100k whenever season one was about to end like these chris alaves these gg players they were above 100k guys i kid you not you hear me the chase young um we can keep on going down like these cards were above 100k you hear me and and now they've just dropped in price they dropped in price you know what i'm saying so these cards are affordable right now that more than they have ever been and we go down to 87s you see like the fred taylor he was a staple for a lot of people's teams jerome the bus you know what i'm saying um ed reed richard sherman you know what i'm saying um james winston you got justin jefferson you got javon curse like these cards were used for a lot of players even pro players and now they drop they they, they owe around 100 to 150k so cam chancellor his price has plummeted richard sherman's has plummeted so right now is a buyer's market um jerry rice the goat like we're talking about 100 to 150k guys so you guys need to go ahead and jump on these cards if you need a boost to your team because they may go up once they start dropping these new promos like team diamonds and much chan i mean um team diamonds and um most feared you know the new unstoppable promo coming out today they may raise um bo jackson still pretty much the best all around running back in the in the damn game it's 180 you know what i'm saying 180k you know mike vick 210 you know javon hargrave 195 you know sean taylor um Sh um lawrence taylor they're barely hanging on to 200k um you know slim reaper barely 200k demarcus rare 250 Warner payton 265 like bro the prices right now are very very low because before season one ended most of these cards are going around 400 500k no lie they're literally going for 400 500k you know what i'm saying i sold this walter payton for like right around 300k so he's already steadily dropping you know what i'm saying you heard me so right now it is a buyer's market and you guys need to get on it as soon as possible before new sets and stuff start dropping because you know 
when EA starts dropping new sets like like the team of the weeks you see how these how these sets um require you to have a certain amount of cards so when you start getting sets that are going to require you to have 86 overalls or 85 overalls or 88 overalls when you start having those sets that you have to include those players in guess what the amount of those prices are going to raise for those said cards you hear me so that's why right now it is prevalent that you jump on it do not do sets right now i repeat do not do sets right now all right don't do it do not do sets at this point in time because a lot of these cards are way cheaper without doing the goddamn sets you got it good just want to make sure y'all know about that right there baby just buy the cards outright right now okay because that's the best way to go because it is a buyer's market at this point in time and if you got cards i would hang on to them if you got some 86s some 87s 85s 88s that you don't really need i would hang on to them and just wait just wait and see how the market changes because right now it's pretty nasty out there if you're trying to sell cards you hear me it's pretty nasty baby besides that what i want to go over we went over what's going on with some of the um you know little field pass things that i found out um that you guys should be aware of told you guys about the market i just want to throw in here a new team update for you guys so on my team right now baby we do have a few changes on offense it's about the same we added the free randy moss down here um just so we can have him in the lineup he is a raider so we'll be upgrading him every 10 levels on the field pass we'll get a new collectible so a level 10 we'll get our first one um george pickens george pickety pickens you know he's on the squad um sweet feet we did have to add him we raised so Dwayne brown because hey why not he's sweet feet bro you know what i'm saying i don't know if that's really his goddamn name he's a ballerina a tap dancer whatever the hell ea got going on you heard me but listen he is the best left tackle supposedly in the game even though he still get his ass block shedded and thrown on the goddamn ground but it is what it is we had to add him to the damn team okay um kevin mawa we did take one team captain token off of him because if you guys saw my last team captain video you could have had 188 team captain and 185 team captain but right now it's different now you can have 184 and 189 or you can still have an 85 and an 88 whichever you way you guys want to swindle it but i needed to take this off of kevin mawa why trey why to put it on airy big berry because Eric Big Barry can be an 89 overall, and we care a little bit more about his position than we do about the center right now. But whenever they drop new objectives for the team captain upgrades, then we will we we will know. I will let you guys know, and we will get Kevin Mawa upgraded more than what he is now. But you can see with Eric Barry and his stats, bro, he's a monster. 88 speed, 89 acceleration. 86 man 90 zone 88 hit power bro he can literally do everything you can line him line him up inside the box outside the box you know what i'm saying have him playing out deep this card is the best team captain easily hands down all right so why did i get trey brown you know what i'm saying trey brown if you look at his card you know hey he's he, his name is trey bro so he gotta be cold right you look at his card 90 speed 91 man okay 82 zone not the best but it can work you know what i'm saying this this guy right here he's fast as hell he's fast as hell with good man so we gotta put him on a squad we're a 25 raider 25 seattle seahawk theme team as you guys can see so it only made sense for me to go ahead and add him to the team and i move richard sherman down here but why trey why you do that to richard sherman right there dog because guess what richard sherman was getting his ass fried across the field like some goddamn raisin canes extra crispy simplicity um kfc finger licking finger licking good you know what i'm saying like bro this dude right here was getting his ass toasted so i was like you know what bro guess what your ass getting demoted so guess what richard sherman he plays safety for me now because with his stats at 87 speed i don't want him anywhere close to the line getting his ass burnt all right i rather him playing backed off coverage i rather him go up against tight ends because hey going up against these fast ass receivers he was getting cooked so guess what richard sherman is playing deep i have eric berry playing deep k 
Cam Chancellor, he is now demoted to playing in the box because the man coverage was killing me. His 70 man coverage was killing me. So him being in the box with my user, if I have to use a cam chancellor, I can. I can put him a man if I want to. I can blitz him if I want to. I can put him in zone if I want to. That's better. That's a better um that's pretty much a better role for Cam Chancellor than having him in man coverage or playing safety. So he's in the box with me now as my as my user, Sean Taylor. Eric Berry's out deep. Richard Sherman playing deep safety. Woodson on the outside. Jay Ram on the outside. Trey Brown in the slot. Sometimes Trey Brown will blitz. Sometimes Cam Chancellor will blitz. Sometimes Joey Blunt would be in on the blitz. And this also helped me not to use this goddamn idiot Quandre Diggs. His card is outdated, he's an 83 overall, and he does not need a big role on the goddamn team. He has been demoted to special teams captain. You hear me? He is the special teams captain. So we no longer need his services on the defense. So that's pretty much how Trey Brown helped us. He helped us a lot. Literally getting this one card right here, helped us a lot and his car dropped from like 300 something k to 284k so i had to snag him guys because it is a buyer's market um big vita veya i did his set okay i did his set for like 300k i did want big daddy warren sapalicious but he's a ltd and his price was still like around the 400 something k mark so i saved my coins went on and got big vita veya you know what I'm saying? And that's pretty much the, the main changes of the team right now. You hear me? The main changes of the team. So I do appreciate y'all for stopping through with your boy. Y'all see it is a buyer's market right now. So get on that auction house and get whatever cards you may have wanted that you may not could have afford back when they were like 300, 400, 500K. Go ahead and take advantage now before the most fear promo drop, the unstoppable promo come out, um, Team Diamonds, get on it ASAP, guys. Um, and also, when it comes to the field pass, you know, stay tuned. We'll have more videos coming out about that as we get more promos and stuff like that dropped. But until next time, it's been your boy. Y'all stay blessed. Bees and stay breezy, man.